Welcome back to BitGaming and another quick quick review. Here's a bunch of uh, resin models that I got. World War II Germans. Got these from the site that does the rapid fire rules. They've got a nice little range of uh, resin vehicles uh, you know, linked on their site. I don't know if they make them or they they buy them or something else off someone else, but. Nice little quality. So it's two staff cars. Two of these, I think, uh, they'll be for um, pulling the uh, anti tank guns. Two of these bigger uh, for pulling artillery. I think that's, I think that's right. Eh? Your um, radio communications truck HQ. And a couple of standard trucks. Very nice. I mean, like I said I think I overall I think I prefer the. Um, so I got these just to see what they're like, really. Overall, I think I prefer the the, the simple kits. I don't want anything too complicated, but um, but it, uh, but the simple ones. But they're good. You know, nice little things. Paint them up. Bosh bosh. The um, you don't really need all that stuff for um, bolt action type games. But on uh, can you see it? Ooh. rapid fire, Blitzky battle groups. Um, on the uh, let me find the rifle. Do, 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 do. Right, well, how easy that is to see. But in this, these things they've got um, uh, they kind of battalion scale, so everything's sort of scaled down uh, in terms of numbers, and. Uh, and you know, and sort of, uh, and of course, it's got, you're more likely to want the transport um, to move your things around. And also, it's just, it's just I don't know, it's just fun really to, to pick one of these um, units and uh, create the right, get the right stuff for it. So you see, on um, these things, you know, you've got your Italian HQ, that's one of the staff cars. The other staff car I'll use for um, forward observers. That's one of the um, uh, KFZ tens. It's a tow for the infantry gun. Uh, also, four trucks there. This is a motorbike thing. It's got a um, lot of motorbikes. Uh, four trucks here for the um, infantry companies. Because the company is only eight, it's eight figures, and then you want a truck for each. A truck for the uh, battalion mortars and a truck for the battalion heavy machine guns. Oops. <laughs> and this is probably, probably a bad way of doing it. Uh, yeah. So anyway, they've got. In these books they've got loads of um, different units and and they're kind of uh, the equipment they the equipment they have um, at a particular scale you know, at a battalion scale so you can you know pick if you want lorry infantry or whatever and then you can uh, get all your get all your bits and pieces for the different ones. I really I do like this. The um it, because of, because of the scale of it, because it's in an Italian sort of scale, you um you, you, you get a few of of a lot of things. So it's like instead of having like a you know, a company of tanks at a one to one scale, it's at um you know, whatever one to five or whatever scale. So you know you have one tank is basically one platoon more or less. And that gives you the option to that gives you the ability to have a lot of variety. Um, because you, know, you you do not you don't need to get five Panzer threes. Well, you, you might, but you generally don't need to, because the company will be um, a mishmash of Panzer ones, Panzer twos, Panzer threes, and Panzer fours. So anyway, blah blah blah. So that's the reason for getting those, because say so you, you don't really need them for things like um, bolt action, or not in like, this sort of scale. But yeah, that's that. I think that's um, I think that should that gives me what I need uh, in terms of. In terms of vehicles, I'll probably get more in the end, but, but anyway, blah blah blah. The um, yeah, so they're good, you know, not too expensive, nice quality, um, yeah, just great, really. Just have to paint them.